So, even though my analysis was spot on, I didn't wait for the upside price target of 1.8 to hit. And you've seen in the last video, I jumped the gun and I went uh, short at 1.4 instead of just staying in my long and waiting on 1.8 and programming to take profit. So, as a result, I did get liquidated. Yeah, that's true. I got liquidated. So, this is the trade right here. You can see that in the event of liquidation, your entire position may be lost. So, I lost 64 XRP. 64 4.39. Then I added more margin, and then I made back 55.4. So right now, I still believe it's at resistance and the price is going to go down. So I took another short. I took another short with low leverage. The reason why I got liquidated is because I put too much high leverage. I put like 19... 19x or something like that whatever so yeah don't over leverage i guess so now i'm back in the trade and i've gotten some xrp back not really but you know what i mean i'm basically back in the game trading and uh now I'm just waiting for the price to go down to my price target, which actually, funnily enough, is that around the entry, well, yeah, around the entry of where my other short was. So that's basically my update. I'm waiting in a shortage right here, and I'm waiting to see, uh, yeah, that's basically it. I'm just waiting for it to go down to the downside price target which would be 1.15 uh, one or 1.4 one or something like that it's actually 1.1 1 .1, but maybe i'll just get out of that price i don't know so 1.14 uh, yeah that seems fair 1.15 even that seems fair because then yeah whatever I could do four eight. Um, it's all the same thing, basically. All right. Well, like, comment, subscribe if you like these liquidation videos, and I'll see you in the next one.